There are developers that were almost a guarantee of quality software, and, conversely, there were developers that were a sure sign of pain and sorrow to come, and no one embodied this more that tear tax. Strider is an action platformer that really shone in the arcades, so hopes were high for the conversion. What 64 owners got was a barely playable car crash of a game with the laggiest controls since the Karnov conversion and vast amounts of the game ripped out including boss battles. It renders the game unplayable to all but the most patient of gamers and should be avoided at all costs. Thumbs down!
The Amiga version gives a good first impression with nice graphics and sound, and all of the arcade's features intact which was enough for many magazines to inexplicably gush about the game. But, and it's a big one, the game is terrible to play with the game feeling very sluggish in both the controls and the speed of the action on screen. Add some iffy collision detection and only playing in two-thirds of the screen, and you have another huge disappointment from the grandmasters of disappointing games. Thumbs down.
Pop, 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 pop,